These TV bullies got what was coming to them. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today, we're counting down our picks for the top 10 dealing with bullies TV moments. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're looking at moments from TV shows that feature bullies being taken down by the bullied or their defenders. We'll be excluding full-on tyrants, such as Khan from Star Trek or Ramsay Snow from Game of Thrones, since they're a bit more than the average bully. Number 10. Barry's Supersonic Punch – The Flash Barry Allen may be the fastest man alive now, but he wasn't always so athletically gifted. As a kid, he was bullied by future metahuman Tony Woodward. I've known guys like you. Peaked in high school, never got over it. All these powers, and look at you. Bully then, bully now. When Woodward abducts Barry's love interest, Iris, the Flash is shocked to find that his bully is now superpowered too, able to transform himself into steel. At first, the super fast hero is unable to break through Tony's skin. However, by pushing himself faster than he's ever gone, he's able to land a supersonic punch, which, with some help from Iris, finally takes Tony down. Supersonic punch, baby! Woo! Number 9. Captain Kirk Fights Finnegan – Star Trek – The Original Series the crew of the Enterprise face many challenges while exploring the final frontier, but one of the greatest is what they've brought with them. Finnegan? I can't believe it. You never know when I'm going to strike. Huh, I'm Jim? <laughs> <How's> Jim? <laughs> while taking shore leave, the crew find their own imaginations and past seemingly coming alive to haunt them. Kirk is confronted with Finnegan, a mischievous bully from his time at Starfleet Academy. The two of them get into a fight, and although Finnegan, who hasn't aged, at first appears to have the upper hand, Kirk bounces back and is able to defeat his former tormentor. <laughs> Number 8. Miley and Lily Get Accidental Revenge – Hannah Montana while Miley Stewart's attempts to keep her identity as teen idol Hannah Montana a secret do help her live an ordinary life day by day, they also leave her vulnerable to ordinary bullies. Well, we'd like to, but we don't speak hillbilly. <laughs> or do our wash down yonder in the creek. <laughs> Two of her most frequent tormentors are Amber and Ashley, who are ironically big Hannah Montana fans. During a camping trip, both bullies do everything they can to embarrass Miley and her friend Lily, who end up locked in a portable toilet, which tips over. Fortunately, since Amber and Ashley watched the proceedings while standing in Poison Oak, it's a hollow victory. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! I call it disgusting! Contagious, isn't it? Number 7. Sam Defends Carly from Jocelyn – iCarly The title character's best friend and co-host Sam can be pretty aggressive, and a bit of a bully. I think of you and me as really close friends. Apparently, I haven't caused him enough emotional pain. After being made aware of this side of herself, in front of a boy she's crushing on, Sam makes an effort to be nicer. But during her attempts to turn over a new leaf, the group encounters even bigger bully Jocelyn, stretching Sam's self-control to the limit. Let me down! No! Can someone call the police? <sighs> when Jocelyn messes with Carly, Carly gives Sam the go-ahead to let Jocelyn have it, which Sam takes to with gusto, managing to take down the bully and impress the boy at the same time. Sam? Yeah? Rip her head off! Rip my head off? I'd love to see her try it! <laughs> Number 6. Spongebob vs. Flats the Flounder – Spongebob Squarepants Out of my way! Out of my way! Can't you see he's gonna kick my butt? In an episode appropriately called The Bully, the cheerful yellow protagonist encounters Flats, the massive bully fish who joins his boating class. Tell the class something about yourself, Flats. Well. I like to kick people's butts. Flats promises to kick SpongeBob's butt, and the hapless sea sponge tries everything he can to escape throughout the episode. Ultimately, though, Flats tracks him down and proceeds to punch him. Gary, I'm absorbing his blows like I was made of some kind of spongy material. Except that SpongeBob did not realize that his soft body would absorb the blows, leading to Flats exhausting himself over the next week in a fruitless attempt to make good on his promise. Do not cheer me, my fellow adult classmates. Flats was the real victim here. A victim of a society that's riding down a violent road to nowhere. A road I call Violence Road. Number 5. Reese Beats Up All the Bullies – Malcolm in the Middle 
The other middle child of Malcolm's family, Reese, epitomizes school bullies everywhere. But when he loses to a girl at wrestling, Reese gives up his role as the school's number one tormentor. And Reese hasn't made me eat grass for a week. Everything tastes better. Unfortunately, this creates a power vacuum, with several lesser bullies vying for the vacant position, and leading to kids who were previously off limits, such as Malcolm's friend Stevie, getting picked on too. This spurs Reese to reclaim his former position by taking down the new bullies in rapid succession, and with great flair, proving that he's the best at what he does. Thanks. Reese? Starting tomorrow, you're back doing my book reports. Sure. Number 4. Wendy vs. Cartman, South Park Eric Cartman might be hilarious, but he's also a pretty despicable bully, so it's always great to see him taken down a peg. One of the best examples occurs after he mocks Stan's on-again, off-again girlfriend Wendy's presentation on breast cancer. Look out, everyone! There's some killer titties on the loose! Wendy promises to fight Cartman after school, which leaves the cowardly scumbag to try everything he can think of to get out of it, even eating his own underwear. Look how hell would I go! Although he briefly appears to have escaped after involving their parents, the principal, a breast cancer survivor, gives Wendy the okay, leading to Cartman being beaten to a satisfyingly bloody pulp. Alright, fine, Wendy! I'll fight you, you big bully! <laughs> Number 3. Steve hires Stan's old bully to beat him up, American Dad. Given how macho the eponymous American Dad Stan Smith is, he's often unable to accept the nerdy and unaggressive nature of his son Steve. Anyway, Steve avoids every obstacle. He's a total wimp. When I was a kid, you used to get your ass kicked if you were a wimp. So in a misguided attempt to toughen his son up, he begins bullying him both at home and at school, relating how his own bully, Stelio Contos, made him the man he is today. Fed up with his father's tactics, Steve tracks down his dad's old tormentor and hires him to beat Stan up, which Stelio Contos executes in epic style, complete with his own theme song. <laughs> Number 2. Steve and Max vs. Billy – Stranger Things While Eleven making Mike's bully Troy wet his pants was quite satisfying, for our money, this is the better bully takedown in Stranger Things. I don't know what you don't understand about what I just said. She's not here. And who is that? Max's stepbrother Billy takes out his frustration at being bullied himself by his father on poor Max and Steve. A confrontation at Will's house leads to a brawl between Billy and Steve, which, although Steve puts up a good fight, leaves Billy the victor. Fortunately, Max is able to hit her obnoxious step-sibling with a tranquilizer, and with some help from a nail-studded bat, put the fear into Billy for a change. From here on out, you leave me and my friends alone, do you understand? Screw you. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. I am talking, and I'm not listening! I don't want your marbles. You can have them back. I only want the ones you took from my friend Rerun. You've won them fair and square. Here, take them. I know when I've been beat. Oh, you better learn to mind your own damn business. <laughs> Number 1. Bart Forms an Army and Water Balloons Nelson, The Simpsons Put him up! Nelson Muntz is among the most famous TV bullies, and he's received several memorable punishments for his bullying over The Simpsons' long run, such as the whole town laughing at him for a change. Hey, everybody, look at this! It's that boy who laughs at everyone! Let's laugh at him! <laughs> Wave to the people! But our pick has to go to this epic occasion in his earliest appearance. After being bullied by Nelson, Bart Simpson decides that he'll seek help from his grandfather, as well as unhinged military veteran Herman. In an homage to war films, Bart then gathers many of his classmates to pelt Nelson with water balloons in a thoroughly epic battle from which Nelson emerges the clear loser. Don't hurt us! Oh, we surrender! Oh, we were only following orders! Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.